Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Liz and today we're going to be talking about, um, well, you're going to be basically coding with me or watching me code, whichever one you prefer. And I'm basically going to struggle through uh, trying to recreate Ali Abdal's website. <laughs> I did like an introduction video and, uh, but I want to show the details. Like I want you to see the struggle and that it's not just like, bam, I'm just whipping this together. Like I want to show the bare bones. So I'm going to do it in like, may I don't want this video to be too long as the thing. So I think I'm gonna do it in like 10 to 20 minute intervals, maybe 15 minutes. I might just stop at 15 minutes. So I'm only allowed to go 15 minutes. I'm gonna stop and then keep going and maybe focus on one thing at a time. But this is gonna take hours. And, but I, I think it's important to show that like, I'm scared. Like I am terrified of this project because I'm a terrible coder. Like I can get things done. I can get down with it, but I'm not very good. <laughs> like it just takes a long time. And I, I just don't want anyone judging me as the thing. But I also think for the people out there who are like afraid to code and suck at coding, it's like, this is for you guys. This is like to see the bare, like the real struggle of trying to trying to do a, try to basically show off something. So I'm basically gonna talk through it. I'm gonna fast forward parts where I'm really silent, um, but I'm 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 just gonna I'm just gonna go for it and try to explain what I'm doing in the thought process. So I think what I'm gonna start off doing. Let's see. I like this template. I want to know where you got this form from. I think I can get this form. So I think I might build this. I think he's using Bootstrap. So let's see. Let's focus on the form. Let's see. I'm going to go to Bootstrap. Forms. While that's loading, I'm going to take a peek at dish code. the fuck is this? What the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna make this full screen. Okay, I'm gonna inspect because I don't understand what those form. For one, he has like some stuff here. Cockles my heart, what? I don't know what that means. That's really weird. Maybe it's a British thing. <laughs> that is the weirdest thing I've ever heard. Okay, so it looks like that's paragraphs. So it's gotta be around here somewhere. Okay, that's this guy. Oh, it's in here. It's in here somewhere. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, form. Yes. So he got it from, I don't, can I grab this? Ha ha ha. Subscriptions. I don't know if this is a real website, but now I'm curious. What the fuck is this? I don't, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna declose that. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I think this is a form that he took off of Bootstrap. Why can't I get this right? Bootstrap forms. Fucking Google. Damn, computer's being slow today. Okay, so it looks like some sort of form. So I think he copied this off the internet. And I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna figure out where you got your form, Ali Abdal. Oh my god, this is so slow. <sighs> Deep breaths. Okay, here we go. I know he's using Bootstrap because I looked at his code and up at the top, he has everything wrapped in a container. Oh, it doesn't look like the whole thing's wrapped in a container. Oh, he has another container. Uh, I feel like whenever you have something wrapped in a container, you're either trying to format everything or you're using Bootstrap. And I wanna use Bootstrap because I wanna make my life easier. If you don't know what Bootstrap is, link below. Did a whole video on it. Basically, you can copy the code and paste it in here, and it's like really nice. This thing is so slow. No, I want to see the forms. I don't know. The second I start filming, it's like, fuck you. 
you can't see code. Oh, here we go. Um, okay, so this form has a first name, email address, and it looks, doesn't look like that. That's for fucking sure. It kind of looks like this, but I need a submit button. These look terrible, these are boring. Uh, this one's a little better. Mm. This one's okay. Oh my god, that's long code. I just want like a very basic. I don't really like this. I want his. Hmm. In line four. This one's better. This one's looking looking good. Cause this one has a is it Oh it's disabled. Okay, duh. <sighs> you Okay, there's way too many options. I don't like this. Does this thing go on forever? Okay, here we go. Going back up to the top. Now that I've looked at every option, I think I'm just gonna go to the basic form here. So I'm going to copy and I'm going to paste. I'm putting it in my HTML because that's where you put it. Don't ask me why I know that. Because I know how to do things. Um, I need it inside the container, so I need to know which divs these are. So I'm gonna go up to the top and make sure there's the container, and I'm gonna follow this freaking line down. Okay, this is a good. Um, he has it in two different columns. So basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to div column six and six because there's twelve. 12 columns in a web in a web page so I need a column six and a column um, six to cut it two and two like these so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do div dot call slash six and basically what I did there is if you do a div dot and then you type in that will be your class and automatically does it rather than me having to type out class so I'm going to do call six and I'm going to copy, copy. I don't know if there's an easier way. If somebody knows shortcuts to friggin' VS code, let me know because I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, and I'm gonna take this form and I'm going to do alt and the up arrow to get it in here because I think it's supposed to be on the right side. <coughs> uh, okay. And I'm just going to leave it as it is. So I'm just going to save. And then on GitHub, um, I made a lot of edits. So I'm just going to be like added form and commit that because just in case my code dies or my computer dies, I have my code. So I'm going to commit that. Freaking work faster. Dying. Okay. Push. Why aren't you working? <sighs> deep breaths, deep breaths. Push to origin. Okay, yay. Let's see how bad that looks. So I'm going to now open up. Where's all the abdominals? Oh, it's on here. I'm going to exit and I'm going to compare to left. And then let's refresh. Why didn't you go on the right side? Maybe because I didn't put anything on the left side. <sighs> I want it to look like that and this is what I'm okay with this because I didn't edit any of the code. So I can delete some of this stuff. I just need to get, I think I'm just gonna put a paragraph here. What is this? What has he got going on here? Sunday snippets. This is an H2 and then he, he's using a H2 and a paragraph. Good to know, thank you. So let's continue. So in here, I'm gonna do an H2 and then I'm going to do a paragraph. 
let's make this what do you want to say i want an emoji i want the male emoji how do i get this male emoji emojipedia and i'm going to get the male emoji i don't even have a mailing list it's okay uh how come he got to like one with like cute little heart actually i think i know a shortcut windows dot Ooh. mail ah that's the one he's using i got it okay i'm actually going to make i feel like i want to make this separate like i want to call this icon class is it dot or is it equals oh it's equals uh, mail icon. Well, I don't know. How did I do the other ones? Shit, this is hard. Oh, I got it. I got it. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna keep this as an H2. And within here, I will div. Fuck me. Uh, mail icon. I'm gonna do dash icon. Dot icon? No, I'm gonna do dash. Tab. And then I'll put this bad boy in here. Alt up up. Delete. And then I might wrap this in here. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna break some Oh shit! Not what I meant to do. Okay, here we go. Sunday. I don't want a Sunday. I want mailing list. Cool. And then what did he say in there? What did you say? Okay, mind blown. Copy. Don't mind me just stealing your words. Fuck that. Why did it move me so? Join a growing community. I don't like friendly readers. Every Sunday I share actionable. I'm gonna remove these unnecessary words. Practical life advice. Directly do, okay, that's okay. Okay, let's go ahead and save that. And we might as well go and push it. Let's see. Um, Mailing information. Okay. Commit to main. And push. Now let's see how it's looking here. Okay. Let's unclick that. Refresh. What the fuck? Why is it not splitting? Did I do that wrong? You sh this should be um, on the left, and this should be on the right. Did I do that wrong? I thought I did div class six. Oh, I forgot this. I forgot to do a row first. Awesome. Okay, let's do this. And then let's move all of this. Shit. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, and I forgot this one. Let's move all of this. Okay. So basically what I forgot to do is you need to have div columns after the rows. So I have this section and this section all within one row. So let's go ahead and save that and put fixed columns to main. I like to push as often as possible um, anytime I make big edits. I feel like that was a big enough edit. And then let's look and see how we're rocking and rolling. So let's do a beautiful guys. We're 
fucking thriving. Now the only thing I need to do is this needs to be in line with this. Uh, I don't know how to do that. And then there needs to be some space here because that's driving me nuts. So let's do make a few more edits and then I think we're gonna stop here because actually, you know, what? I'm gonna stop here because that was, it's already been like 15 minutes. It's like time flies when you're trying to code something by scratch. Okay, so it still looks like shit, but I got it kind of. Like I have a form, which I can edit. You know, you click in here, very similar to clicks in here. I like that there's no blue, so I need to get rid of that blue. I need to edit some of this, but you can see like the process is quite tedious and long, but this is basically what I do for hours on end, trying to get this freaking website like semi-manageable. Um, so I'm just gonna keep working on it. And um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching me struggle through this and I will just keep posting 15 minute, 15 to 20 minute intervals um, for you guys to just continue watching me struggle through this. And then eventually I'm going to have a website, but at least it's keeping me accountable. But anyway, I hope this helps you guys and um, I'll see you guys next time.